Hey everybody, it's Gary the Google Guy here and there's a new update to Google Docs that you may not be aware of unless you saw the pop-up and have maybe dismissed it. And that is the option to now use pageless formatting in Google Docs. Now you'll see I've got a Microsoft Word file and this is a perfect example of when this could come into play. In Microsoft Word you have the ability to create these pageless boundaries of being able to create really long and wide say images or tables, things of that nature. In this case, we have a table that was put together by a client and you'll see as I bring it into Google Docs, it is running halfway off the page because of that formatting aspect. So here's what you can do. If you go to your file menu, if it's a Microsoft Word file you're bringing in, save it as a Google Doc. Once it is in Google Docs, what we're going to do is we are going to change that page formatting over to pageless as opposed to the eight and a half by 11 standard. What that's going to do is it's going to allow us to see the entire field that has been put into play. And you'll see in this view, even as a Google Doc, it is going to be in that cut off state on that far right side of our screen. And just to scroll down to give you a little bit of a view, you'll see that it's got that and then it separates and goes into another page at the bottom there. But the right side is all cut off. So here's what you can do to remedy file menu. Go down to page setup and underneath page setup you will now see a new option. In the upper right you'll see the option for pageless. Now you can also as a Google Doc create this from scratch as pageless. But what this is going to do is it's going to allow you to create a surface that expands to whatever device or screen you're using. So you'll make it a little bit easier to work with wide tables, large images, or detailed feedback and comments. So you don't have to be stuck to just that screen. The other nice piece is you'll still have that option to do a print to fit if that's what you need. But let's change this over to pageless. Bottom right corner will go to OK. And now as it kind of converts it to that pageless boundary, we should now see that in that pageless boundary, we can see the entire right side of that table, the way it was put together in Word and come over. And it's a single page now, so it's not multiple pages. So if this is something that you're having an issue with, you've created it in Word or it was created by someone else in Word, you bring it over into Google Docs as that Microsoft Word format, convert it into Google Docs format, then go to the page layout and change it to pageless. Now, of course, if you are creating a new Google Doc in your Google Docs, once again, if you want to just start right from the get go without being tied to a border, you would go to file, go to page setup, upper right, pageless, and you can start right off the bat in that pageless formatting. And now we can start creating that ginormous table or whatever we would like to do there. So this will be a really helpful tool, especially if you've got existing artifacts that you want to bring into Google with maybe some of those boundary type issues. Until we meet again, another day, another time, another update. This is Gary, the Google guy, signing off.